Good morning, Devils. Come with us on this short week as we congratulate our seniors, check in with the Murdoch community, and take a look at a special segment from our Blue Devil Weekly group. All that and more today, Wednesday, November 24th, 2020. Welcome back, Murdoch. To start off this episode, we'd like to make a quick reminder that there is no school tomorrow or Friday because of Thanksgiving break. There's also a half day today with a dismissal of 1030. Last week, we held the Mass College App Celebration where we had several students get accepted to colleges. We'd like to congratulate the following students who were accepted. Daniel Fuller was accepted to Salem State University. Kelsey Boucher was accepted to Franklin Pierce University. Michaela Marston was accepted to Franklin Pierce University, Salem State University, Arcadia University, Bridgewater State University, Worcester State University, Mount Wachusett Community College, and Fitchburg State University. Ronan Cass McBride was accepted to Salem State University. Oleani Noble was accepted to Bridgewater State University and Salem State University. Taylor Patterson was accepted to Fitchburg State University. Evelyn Haley was accepted to Fitchburg State University and Franklin Pierce University. Kevin Pesci was accepted to Fitchburg State University. Madison Constantino was accepted to Mount Wachusett Community College. Maria Vaccarello was accepted to Salem State University. Preston Roberts was accepted to Mount Wachusett Community College. And Trinity Savoy was accepted to UMass Dartmouth and Franklin Pierce University. Congratulations, everyone. Last Friday, we had another Flex Block Advisory. Some of the activities included board games, cooking and baking, learning about murder mysteries, cross-stitching, sewing and making dream catchers, relaxing, or playing dodgeball. The Murdoch Varsity Cheer Team competed at States this weekend at Worcester State University. They placed fourth out of eight teams. <laughs> To wrap up the season for cross country, Avery Murphy and Lillian Skowinski ran at the All-State Meet this past Saturday at Rentham Development Center. Avery ran her personal best for 3.1 miles in 19 minutes 36 seconds, finishing in 14th place, and Lillian ran a time of 22 minutes 15 seconds. Our team has been working hard this year to bring you an episode of Blue Devil Weekly every week, but despite what you see on screen, things don't always go as planned. Let's take a look at some of the bloopers from this year so far. Good morning, Murdoch. This week we recap... Welcome back to the Murdoch Sport. You shook the camera. <laughs> Imagine we did it perfect. Dude, our bloopers are going to go crazy. Yeah. Temps will be in uh, high, low. I cannot focus. Their next game is Tuesday, October 5th at the Honto. The Murdoch Gardner field hockey team had three games there. Congratulations to the girls for their hard work and success. You had one success. It, dude, success. One sentence. That's like one of those words for me that you're just gonna get mixed up. Successful. Me to say it? Do you want me to say it? Successful. I'll say it. Good morning, Myrna. This week we like to insist. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Now here's the upcoming five-day forecast. Temps will be in the. I started with temps. I need. Thank you, Dan and Kelsey. The Murdoch can what? restart it. I don't know what happened. <laughs> I was Good morning, Murdoch. Follow us through this week as we take a look at the new civics project. <laughs> yeah, Mur <laughs> yeah. There's words there. <laughs> the Murdoch Gardner field hockey team had three games this past week as well. They took a two to one loss against Narragansett and had a big three, six to one, dude, I said three. I don't know where I got three. I don't know where I got three. I don't, I almost did it, dude. Why is this Thank you, Dan and Kelsey. The cheerleading team has a competition tomorrow, October 30th in Willington. Some. <laughs> I do. Some. I do. Thanks, guys. Now here's the upcoming five day forecast. Temps would be sunny with the temps, uh, Temps to be sunny. Temps to be sunny. I work. College and college work. Make it go. Ah, ah, ah. Then we'll shoot across the sky. Sky. 
<laughs> Here we go. Happy Halloween, Murdoch. Come with us this week as we recap important updates and reminders. Overview sports and events going on at Murdoch and review the college information. All that <laughs> and more to... Thank you, Dan and Kelsey. Last week, our co-op soccer and golf teams finished their fall season. We got to interview a few of our athletes and get the recap of this past season. The cross-country team uh, had the... No, no, no. See, see. We, we like to dress... <laughs> <laughs> One, two. One, three, two. four. Buckle my shoe. Three, four. Kick down the door. Five, hey. six. Pick up sticks. Yeah. Shout out. Welcome back, everyone. Kicking off our episode this week, we're going to turn it over. <laughs> <laughs> the Murdoch Gardner field hockey team also had three games this past week as well. They had, it took a... <laughs> Good morning, Murdoch. This week we looked into college success, future... future Thank you, Kelsey. Thank you, Kelsey. Here's... Said it too fast. That is it for this week's sports recap. Back to you and Dan. You had three words. Duh. Back to you and Dan. Back to you. That's going to do it for this week's episode, but be sure to stay updated with what's going on at Murdoch by following us on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok at Murdoch HS. And if you aren't already subscribed to our channel, be sure to, as well as click the notification bell to be notified of future uploads. Have a good Thanksgiving, everyone, and we'll be back next week.